Hi there. In this video I am gonna show you, how you can convert your website into native mobile application. Now I've already made a video on how you can convert your website, into a mobile application using free online tool. If you haven't watched it yet, watch it here. Now let's get to our topic. As of July 2021, 56.75% of all web traffic came through mobile phones. Which means that if you have an e-commerce website and an application for that, people would prefer to buy from your app, instead of website. So why not turn your website into an app? While surfing on the internet you must have noticed something. That some websites have this option which says, that add this website to home screen. What that option do is, it takes your website and convert it into mobile application, and install it in your device automatically without going to Google Play Store. Sounds good right? Now let's get to it. And by the way you can do this to any WordPress website. So first we need to install a plugin. So to install it, hover on plugins and click add new. Now search for, PWA. This is the plugin that we need to install, so click on install now. Now click activate. Cool. Now we need to tweak some settings. Here you need to define your app name, short name for your app, and a description. It's auto-filled for me. But if you want to change it, go ahead and do it. Now upload your app logo. I've created mine. So I am gonna upload it. Click on select icon. Now upload your splash screen. If you don't know what splash screen is, a splash screen can appear while a program is launching. A splash page is an introduction page for an app. Now choose background color for your app. I am gonna set it to white. Now set the theme color for your app. More like primary color. Now you need to specify your front page when your app starts. I am gonna select home page. Now choose offline page for your app. The page you select here will open in your app even without internet. Set its orientation to portrait because most of the app's orientation are in portrait. Now choose you display mode. Currently it's set to standalone. Display mode decides which UI to show you in your app. Like it's not cool if you see URL bar in your app. Now in the status section, you need to make sure one thing. That your website must have a SSL certificate. If you have this mini padlock icon right next to your URL bar, it means you have SSL certificate. Now click on save changes. Now let's check. Here you can see, now I have this option too, I can also add this website to mobile. This is my client's website that I created for them. It's a great brand. And they were great people. Also they like this website so much. So if you want me to create website for you, contact me on my email. webtrackofficial at gmail.com Here you can see, the website is added to my home screen. Now let's see the home screen. As you can see, our app is now installed successfully. Open it. This is our splash screen. That we set. And now this is our complete website, which now is in our Android application. It's all the same website. Just like that, you can create as many apps as you want. You can purchase the items from the app. Also the changes you make in your website, will automatically update in your app. If this video helped you in any way, like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you later, alligator. Thank you.